Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the main release, which is the build 22000.652 or KB5012643 if you're interested in the build code. And as I've talked before about Windows 11 and uh, its builds, this build contains mostly all the changes and improvements that were available in the release preview channel from two weeks before. Of course, the good news is, is that with every new Windows 11 build for the main release, release that we get, Windows 11 is closing in to the 22H2 release, which is highly expected, and I truly think that that version of Windows 11 will improve the Windows 11 experience a lot and will also add a lot of new changes and improvements that will be really nice for the users. Of course, before talking about anything, please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel if you want to be up to date with every video that we make on the Windows 11 builds topic. So let's continue with the video. In this build, Microsoft updated a few issues that might cause video subtitles to be partially cut off and also an issue that incorrectly aligns video subtitles. I think this is for Windows 11 apps that play videos, of course, if you play a movie or something like that. In previous builds, you could have had some issues with subtitles, so in this build that should be fixed. Of course, in this build, as we knew, Microsoft is now displaying the temperature on top of the weather icon in the taskbar. And also, Microsoft updated an issue that prevented you from using the minimize, maximize, or close buttons on a maximized window in the operating system. In this build, interestingly enough, we have some improvements for servicing the secure boot component of Windows and also for the TPM component of Windows 11. I'm not really sure about these improvements. Microsoft is not saying a lot of details, but I think that's related to security improvements and stuff like that. So that's always good news. And also an update that we've talked before is that Microsoft fixed some issues when you were trying to install some M6 apps basically apps that you could normally find on the Microsoft Store, so that's also fixed. Also, as you know, if you've watched the previous video that I've made on the previous build of Windows 11 for the release preview channel, we've talked about some fixes that were applied that could delay the restart or the startup of the operating system up to 40 minutes, and now Microsoft is giving us more details about that. So basically, they addressed an issue in, in which certain point-of-sale terminals experience occasional OS startup delays during restart of up to 40 minutes. They also addressed a memory leak issue that we had on the previous build and also a few BSOD errors that you could encounter in previous builds. Again, not much is happening in these builds for the main release, but I still keep you up to date. So if you're interested in these videos, of course, it's uh, very helpful if you watch them. Also, lastly, in this build, Microsoft also did a servicing stack update as they do in every build, practically makes quality improvements to the servicing stack, which is the component that installs Windows updates. Of course, there are a lot of other quick fixes or small things that were added and fixed in this build of Windows 11 for the main release, but you can find the whole list in the article down below in the description. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.